Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. As we come to the end of the year 2021 and welcome the year 2022, it is my pleasure to send you my warmest wishes for a joyous and prosperous new year. In life, as is in driving, the rare view mirror reflects what we have left behind. 2021 is now behind us and we look forward through the windshield to the future with our eyes set on what lies ahead. I have taken some time to look back to the past year. I am most grateful to the Almighty God that he has carried us through the many challenges and difficult moments we witnessed. I feel encouraged to say that working together we have accomplished significant milestones in implementing our transformative agenda of making Marsabit a better county. Whilst we have acted boldly and prudently in many issues and made a tremendous difference in Marsabit, the year 2021 was marred with many unfortunate incidents with tribal undertones and ethnic conflicts. This will be of great concern to all of us, since it is an indication that there are always certain elements who want to throw a spanner into the wheel that is propelling Marsabit forward. But instead of being deterred by those for whom unity and progress is a problem, we should work harder than ever before to defeat them with unity and progress. I reassure you tonight that your government remains on course, our plans are in place, and that we are moving forward. We have every reason to believe that the promise of a better future cannot be undone by the difficulties of the present. The new year stands before us like a chapter in a book waiting to be written. Now is the time to think about the story we would like to write in 2022, remembering that we are the authors of our destinies. As the people of Marsabit, only you and I can script the next chapter of our common destiny. Our dream is to bequeath to our children a Marsabit in which Everyone has equal opportunity to pursue their dreams and must be defined by peace, love, and prosperity. Let us uphold violence and maintain maximum vigilance against all efforts from within or without to disturb our peace and security, especially as we approach the electioneering period. Let us refuse to be divided along ethnic or political lines but celebrate the unique diversity that we are blessed with and promote tolerance and understanding amongst all Marsabit communities. As your governor, I give you the promise to dedicate myself to the full implementation of my objective of building a united, inclusive and prosperous Marsabit where no one feels left out. Let the new year 2022 be a year of peace progress and harmony, where goodwill and brotherhood shall prevail amongst our people. May God bless you with joyous and peaceful days throughout the year 2022.